To Kaduna now, mixed reactions have continued to throw the deadline for swapping the old 200, 500 and 1,000 Naira notes. Residents in the state in their large numbers visited the Central Bank of Nigeria branch to deposit their road notes. Plus, the Venice correspondent Habila Dorofa's report is presented from our studios. Youths, including men and women, were visible at the CBN for cash swap with their old currency notes. The residents were disappointed after spending hours only for the officials to collect their data without swapping the cash as expected. Some of the residents described the process as terrible. They told me that I shall uh, uh, go to inside and I went inside. This and I went to the, the site, you write my name, my phone number, and the amount of the money I was supposed to deposit. They didn't collect anyone. The money, see the money now? But though, because now I, I suppose to not travel, I won't travel. I want to use the money, they say they don't want to collect. When I went there, they say we should just submit our names only and their account number. So I don't know that we should just went out with the money. We should go back with the money back. So they will just call us. Spend about three hours here, since in the morning, begging them to help us and release the new money, the, the new notes for us so that we can able to use them. Because like now the situation is very, very bad. If you can check, you see it. While some express dismay that the government and the CBN are insensitive to their plight, others say the policy is to better the lot of Nigerians. Life is um, very, very difficult, especially for we, the ordinary people. We are suffering and uh, it's, I fear that our leaders are very insensitive to the flight of the ordinary people. If they were, they will have factor bigs before even they went into implementing this uh, kind of harsh policy. The policy may be, may be good, but uh, the timing and also the way they are circulating the new notes uh, is, totally, is totally, you know, wrong. Everybody will enjoy later. Let's be patient. I'm pleading to the public that let's be patient and pray. The only solution is for us to pray for better Nigeria, and that is our prayers. Let's pray for better Nigeria. It go better, it go better. There's no any bad thing there. Okay. You know, definitely anything that is happening, there will be consequences. And at the end, when you uh, you exercise your patience, you are going to see the outcome of it. I believe the government and the institution that uh, come up with this law, they know their targets, they know their aim. And I believe it's for the benefit and the betterment of us, all Nigerians. Meanwhile, they appealed to the government to take a second look at the policy and be sensitive to their plight. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.